In this video, I will show you how to build and deploy any Docker image to Google Cloud. The first thing you want to do is make sure you have a Google Cloud account. So go to cloud.google.com and create an account there. And then the next step would be to install the Google Cloud uh, CLI. So you need to follow the steps here to install a uh, command line interface. So after you have finished installing this CLI, uh, go back to the Google Cloud Console. So do that to do that, click this console button. And then from here, you want to create a new project. So I'll just name your project name, whatever. And then click create. Now it's done, uh, select the project. And then now from here, you, you want to enable uh, three APIs on Google Cloud. So the first one will be called Artifact Registry. So just search up Artifact Registry. Click Enable. error just it's fine just click uh, retry if you get this error all right so now it's uh, enabled go back enable uh, the next one will be cloud build search up cloud build and enable this one All right, this one's done as well. And then the final one is, uh, should be cloud deploy. And then just enable this one. All right, so now this part is done. After you make your Google Cloud account, you want to make sure you have billing enabled. So to do that, click the menu and then click uh, there's this billing tab. So just click that. And uh, so I already have this, I already set this up, but you need to set it up. And so you will need a credit card to do this, but it won't charge you. Um, since uh, you go out here, you see that uh, you do get a, a bunch of uh, free credits to use. Now, the next step will be logging into Google Cloud in the terminal. So um, you should already have the CLI installed at this point. So we'll just do Google Cloud auth login. And it should pull up this page and then you have to sign in. And then uh, allow. And then now you should be able to, to you should now be signed in. And now the next step is uh, you want to set um, the current project to the project you just created. So for me, I already uh, did this, but just to do it again, just do G Cloud config set project. And this project ID is uh, from before. So if you go back to the uh, the uh, dashboard of the project you just made, you probably do, the project ID is right here. So just copy this. All right, and now we should be good to go. So my Docker um, image is just like, this is, uh, I'm just using the create React app example here. Um, so it's very simple. And as you see, my Docker file is right here. Very simple, very simple. So 
you you want to make sure that uh everything works locally first so uh just run these commands blocker build whoops dot dot the docker run BP yeah. Alright, so now I just run it locally just to make sure it works. So let's go to localhost 3000 and you see that it's now running on Docker and everything works. So now we can um, build and deploy this on Google Cloud without any issues. So to do that, um, go back to the terminal and you need to run um, this command g cloud artifacts repository create and then um, so what we're doing here is creating a folder for uh, the docker image so we just uh, need to name a name for this folder just call this yeah just name it whatever you want And then we need to add this option repository format equals docker and then the location option for me i just go with uh us central one you can, you can choose uh, whatever you want and then finally uh, description option all right so now click enter and it should be creating uh, this folder. All right, so now it's done, created the repository, and uh, we can actually go back here and check. So just search up artifact registry. And we see that, okay, this is the folder that we just made. The next step will be building our Docker image and uh, storing it in this folder. So to do this, back to the terminal, and we run this command, gcloud build submit, and then you need to pick a region again. So we just go uh, with the same one, for me, US Central 1. And then uh, we need a tag name. So this part is important. So for the tag name, uh, you want to go back to the artifact registry here and then click into it. And then you see here that uh, this should be this copy icon to get the, the full name. So we'll just copy this here. And then paste it here. And then after that, you need to add a, you want to have a name uh, name for this image. So you just add a slash and then uh, name it whatever you want like. So I'll just name it this, React GCloud example image. And then you need a colon and then add this tag one here. So this is just giving you giving this a tag. Uh, you'll see later uh, why we need this. So just click enter here. And now we should be building our Docker image. Okay, so if you get if you run into this uh, issue, we enabled it already enabled the API, but it's fine, just Yes, again, just enable it again. Okay, I named it wrong. Uh, spelling error. So I'll just fix this real quick. Uh, my bad. US Central 1 here. All right, now she's good to go. So this would take a couple of minutes.
all right now it's finally done and now uh we go back to the artifact registry uh the folder we the this folder we made and just refresh the page you should see our our docker image so it's now we have uploaded it successfully now the final step is just deploying it so to do this we just run g cloud run deploy and then the image name is uh so go back here and click on uh this image you just uploaded and you're able to, you're able to copy the uh, entire name and you see here that uh the reason we had to add a tag is because we need uh, tags for the docker image so we have you see this tag here so just paste here and don't forget the colon tag one and then enter and now it'll ask you for some options so is whatever you want to name the service again i guess we need to just enable it here i guess again so yes and uh now we just select a server I went with I went with US Central one, so I'll be going with that again. And here, uh, yes, just put yes here. And now it should be deploying. Now, you see that's done. And it has given us a service URL. So now the moment of truth. Copy this and paste it here. And there we go. We see that we have deployed it to Google Cloud. Now to just to check to be sure we can search up here cloud run. And here you see that uh, this is a service that we just made. So there you go. Uh, this is how to deploy a Docker image, build and deploy a Docker image to Google Cloud.